Hey everybody, it is Odin. Welcome back to Rogue's Tale. Today we continue our quest to unlock more heritages, hopefully, and uh, to get, you know, better and better gear and get further and further in the dungeon. So today our name, we're going to go with, we're going to go with Tiwaj this time, but we're going to use the A's to, to differentiate these different generations. Where eventually we're going to have a long stream of A's here. Okay. So we're set up for a ranged build, but I think we're going to start with melee. Alright. So we found ourselves uh, already in a predicament here. Well, let's... I can't tell if they are... They still need to move one more square, so I'm going to give them a turn. Okay, they were still able to attack me. I don't know why. Alright, there we go. Okay, level 2. I'll take it. So we'll put our strength up at 9. We're going to pick up this damaged mace. Oh man, well I guess we'll have to finish this fight. There we go. Now we're going to switch to the mace. Because here we have D3 plus 1. Here we got D6 minus 1. Still a little bit better. Uh, we need to rest already. Okay, I haven't even searched yet. There we go. This is a very interesting setup. I don't think I've seen the level arranged in this corridors, like multiple corridor fashion. That's interesting. Alright, there is a buckler. Now, if we use a medium and a shield, I think that uses the strength modifier, so that's what we're looking for. Yeah, this is a very interesting layout here. Oh my god. Didn't I... No, I never did walk over that specific area. That's good. Very good. Uh, I was going to say, is one of these not damaged? No, they are both damaged, unfortunately. Uh, you leave me little choice. I mean, I could rest and let you move on, but we're not going to do that. Okay, maybe we are. I lied, is what happened. <laughs> I have not been searching enough. Alright, tomes are always good. Actually, let's finish up looking down here. So that snail is caught in the trap. There you go. And you repay me by just sitting there. You are now dead. Oh, hell yeah. Some worn chain armor. That will work. That will definitely work. Alright, we have reached level 3 already. That was a <laughs> it felt very quick. And it was. There's a rock. Alright, I'm going to use the numpad here. Just for a moment. Make this a little easier. I do like using the mouse generally, but every now and again I, I will switch over to the numpad for movement once I've already like searched and oh speaking of searching. We really can't disarm this thing, are you serious? Well luckily there's nothing over there, so I was just hoping to get some XP. Oh, I didn't think about the diagonal attack there. Alright, let's drink some water and eat some food. Heal up. Oh, there's a wand. That is another good thing to have next to the tome, because you can identify them and sell them back for more than you paid to identify them. Uh, oh, I can't believe they got a shot off on me there. I really want to see what's in there. There's nothing we can do about this, right? Yeah. I don't think... I don't think I can jump onto that, so I'm pretty sure that's just going to stay where it is, unfortunately. But here's something else. Some bolts will do. Uh, I never use the scrolls, and that's why I'm not picking that one up. Oh, hey. Worn plate cap. We'll definitely take that. Switching back to the numpad there. Whoa. I mean, I'm pretty invested into this map. I might as well see what's 
going on here. See, there's so much... Wow, this level is very large. Oh, crap. Where did you come from? Alright, let's switch to the numpad. pad. I mean, I probably should have just moved on to the next floor. But, uh, you know. I don't often make the best decisions. I have a spear. It's undamaged. So that's kind of interesting. Alright, let me look here. So that's D6 plus 1. We get some added defense here when we're using this setup, which is, why I, which is why I kind of like it for now, to be honest. Whoops. Uh, another spear, damaged axe. Some bolts to sell. You know what? I haven't seen any torches, have I? That just dawned on me. Mm. Level four. By the time I get to the second floor, I'm already... I'm in probably... I don't know if when it is that the monsters or the mobs scale. You know what I mean? I don't know if they scale, like, from floor to floor or from dungeon to dungeon. All right. I mean, we're fully committed, man. We're fully committed. We spent so much time on this damn floor. Don't want to pick up the scroll. Uh, there's a schematic. Uh, there's a... Could be useful. now. I just don't see myself using that. Well, because I don't see myself using this combo much longer, but... Let's take a look. 1, 4, D6... Well, let's just switch it up. Let's do it. This is a crazy... Oh, shit. Oh, good lord. This is a crazy map. Alright, using Q to jump there. Alright, definitely using the numpad now. I know there's a little bit more to explore. Oh, crap. What did that leave something behind? Oh, scrap. Oh, sweet. Some crafting stuff. Oh, and that reminds me. A viewer pointed out that... Oh, man. Level 5. Uh, so we already put one in strength. Put one in stamina. Um, no, a viewer reminded me that we can store gold. Uh, as well as crafting items. Man, these snails are so irritating. Okay, how... What? Bear skin. Well, I guess because it was a bear trap. Alright, whatever. Alright, well, now we gotta drink twice and eat twice. And we can finally move on to the next floor. I really hope it's different. Uh, and it looks different, so that's good. Alright, so we're already in a, a, another kind of bad situation right from the start. I guess I should try to go for this dude first. This is bad. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't really stand a chance there, if you ask me. Alright, here lies t -Wass, man of zero talent. Of course. Okay, so... Hey, we ended up right... That's not, that's not so bad. Unless I used the, that exact spelling before. Maybe I did. No, I don't think so. All right, so we're going to add another A. And we're going to keep it melee for now. And let's dive back in. All right, damaged axe. I wish it were undamaged, but that'll do for now. That's such a strange map. Can't get over that. All right. And there were no doors either, were there? Another thing I didn't really notice. All 
right. Let's check the rest of this. There we go. Some worn padded armor. It'll do for now. Hopefully we can find some leather armor at the very least. Hey, there's a wand. Always a good find, as we discussed earlier. Hey, some worn chain armor. And a damaged mace. I don't really want the scroll. Let's switch that out. Toss that. Oh, I should have lit that. There we go. I like to get just a little bit of XP, but not too much. That's why I'm leaving the snails alone. Alright, next floor. Get some gold. Alright, that'll definitely be a better shield. Toss that, just to keep the inventory nice and spacious. And the dungeon is cleared. Okay, so put a point into strength. And we can go back to town. So I didn't pick up any arrows or bolts, and I, but I, and I don't have enough gold to identify the wand, which is unfortunate. So there's not really anything we can do here. Other than, whoops. Oh, oh my god, what is wrong with me? There we go. Alright, gonna grab that bread. That's open. Now that's a that's a nice looking buckler, but I think we're still doing better with this. Yeah. Alright, so there's some worn leather armor. Now it's a little bit late for that, I think. Uh Depends. Well, I, I actually, we're, yeah, I want to keep the chain. I want to keep the chain. Alright, scroll that I'm just not going to bother with. I don't have any talent points, so we can't use that. Oh my god, get out of my way, snails. Alright, now there we have a talent point. But the question is, do I want any of these things? And maybe I do. Dark vision is interesting. But that would be something to use when using an agility build, looks like, because it has the ranged attack to hit range modifier. Hmm. Ah, uh, well, you know I like keen eye. Silent cast doesn't make any sense. Um, now this could be something interesting because a lot of the times we end up getting our ass kicked because we're terrified or confused for that matter. That's a really interesting, that's an interesting thing to, I'm going to try that. I'm going to try that. Hopefully we'll live long enough to actually apply it. But oftentimes when we fight weird looking creatures, they get us with the the fear thing and when the character starts screaming and running around and then you get the confusion effect that is very damaging stuff so to be able to resist that or at least have a shot at resisting it I think is pretty damn cool oh get out of the way snails alright moving right along Oh, I wish I'd find a campfire, man, so I could get my heroic charge, because I love it. There we go. Oh, man, I should have just waited a second. Would had I uh, could have got a flurry of uh, blows or whatever it is that one is that would increase my attacks. Whenever I used it, my attack damage. Damn it. That's all right. And there we go. I was going to say, I'm about to bust it down. I definitely like a more conventional map like this. I definitely prefer this to that last thing we dealt with. Alright, a th damage throwing knife. Eh, you never know. Oh, that's an interesting sound. Whoa. Nice. Level 4. 
Okay, now that's not damaged. That's great. There's a wand. There's some gold. And uh, we'll take this potion. Who knows? Who knows? We might actually try to do something with it. Alright, so we're going to switch out here. There we go. Alright. Oh, that's a dog, so we don't necessarily have to worry about that. Was that the sound I was hearing? I guess it was. I did not recognize that as the dog sound. Ooh, studded armor. Oh, man. 3-2-2-2. That's 4 two, one, one. This uh, honestly seems better. I don't know that it is necessarily, but we're going to hold on to that just in case. Uh, right. Okay. And that appears to be everything. Now... As I understand it, you can... Well, I need to drink and eat. You can, like, you can use food, I think, to, to make allies, but I don't think it applies to a dog, and I don't know how to do it. But part of me thinks, maybe I should just throw this bread at the dog and see what happens. It attacked me! I was throwing some bread at you, dude! What the hell, man? Damn. I'm a bad-tempered dog, man. Bad-tempered. That is just a worn leather cap. And some arrows. There's a trap up there. Get that XP. No, that's not going to move that way. What am I thinking? Okay, well, not going to move it at this time anyway. Oh, I ex oh man, I almost <laughs> almost broke that apart by accident. Probably would have ended up the RNG giving me a damn zombie or whatever that thing is that comes out of there. Uh, that's worn studded armor. We've got the good stuff. There's a little individual mushroom there. Oh, there must be something in here. Yep. Now, are you cool? I don't think you are. No, you're not. There we go. Level 5. Alright, put that into stamina. Take that gold, that studded cap. Uh, this is three one two three, two one three three. Mm. This is better physical resistance, and that's kind of what I'm looking for right now. Even though magical damage should be what I'm trying to shore myself up against, since uh, when you end up fighting tougher enemies, it seems that the use of magic becomes more and more common. I could be uh, generally wrong about that, but I mean it feels like that's the case. I honestly did not... Uh, that happens a lot. <laughs> did not mean to do that. Water and food. Okay, so I need to get out of range. I can't just walk right at this guy, because he's going to eat me up with arrows. Oh, man. This I guess we're going to go for it now. He's been missing, luckily. There we go. That could have been much worse. Could have been much worse. Uh, you know, it no, it, it wouldn't make much sense to try and use ranged weapons when I don't put any points into agility. So, not gonna do that. Um, I was pondering whether or not I should create a second weapon set here, and but I don't really want to use a dagger. So, but it'd be a way to help manage the inventory a little bit better in the future, anyway. Grab these, because I can sell them. And we're going to put this on, even though it's... You know what? No, we're going to hold on to that. Not not quite yet. I'm going to try and identify that after I identify the, uh, the wand. i just grab both of these for now.
I got my XP. Might as well bash it down. Okay, so... 3123... 3222... Two, two, two. Eh. I don't know. This seems just slightly better. Oh, I didn't even have my weapons equipped this whole time. That was brilliant. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, you harvest a blood cap from the mushroom patch. Oh, that's new for me. Oh, there we go. I was going to say, oh, come on, don't. We can't lose here. Oh, man. Oh, right, yeah, give me that water flask and your food. Thank you. That's a damaged mace. Is our studded helm worn? It is. It most certainly is. All right, it's time for you to go. And I'm not going to pick up the scroll. I will pick up the gold, however. And we will drink and eat and heal. Okay, this could, uh, who knows which way this could go here. Alright, that's not too bad. And again, I don't remember if there would have been any kind of psychological effect by that creature. Oh, crap. But if so, we are pretty well protected against it. Bring on the snake. Hatchet. No, thank you. Oh, crap. Oh, okay. Well, this way they can't double team me. Oh, man, what happened? You are deafened, and that prevents you from enjoying the awesome sounds of this game. <laughs> I didn't know you could be deafened. Oh, man, that that, that hurts. That doesn't feel very nice. <laughs> it's kind of uncomfortable. Oh, hey, look at that. Some meat. Damaged sword with deafening poison. That would be a good thing to fix and hold on to, wouldn't it? Man. Alright, we have to eat. And heal. And, oh, man, that, that sounds so weird. Now this is a good find right here because now we can get our heroic charge. There we are. So there's our passive one that we have. Got an amulet. You're still deafened. This is ridiculous. Uh oh hey, a shop level. No, it's not a shop level. You've got to be kidding me. Of course we can't hear anything. And I'm... I am dead. I have no... <laughs> I have no idea what happened there, but we certainly died with uh, the deafening poison, and we're still deafened. That's a new one, man. That's a new one. That duelist, I was hitting him with all I had, but that was not going to be enough, apparently. And I at first, as you saw, thought this was a shop level. I was like, all right, yeah, cool. Nope. Nope. <laughs> So anyway, thanks for hanging out today and checking out some Rogue's Tale. I always appreciate it when you guys are here. Uh, please hit like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you guys next time.